Hey guys, so we're going to be making some super easy, trendy press-ons out of these Novo Ovo pre-French instant apex type nails. These are available on Amazon and I just want to show you, I know I've talked about them in a separate video, they are so strong, like I'm trying so hard to bend them and they do not bend at all. So if you're in the market for some extra long, and they're pre-buffed. <laughs> Um, these are extra long, so if you're in the market for some pre-French instant apex type nails, I'm pretty sure these are the only ones like these available. You should check these out. They're on Amazon. They're awesome. So, we're going to do some trendy press-ons. Honestly, the easiest press-ons ever, and I'm excited to wear these as press-ons because um, they should be super strong. So, I already sized out my nails, as always, and I am going to just place them down on my putty, and we're going to get started. So, I'm trying to go for, like, that effortless, um, French vibe, obviously, but that Hawaiian flower look that's really popular. Um, I got some perfect stickers in my Vetsy um, mini August box that I wanted to use for this because I think it's absolutely perfect and they turn out so cute. So another nice thing about these, since they're pre-French, they're ready to go, ready for any add-ons that you want to do, any painting, anything like that, and you don't have to buff, and you shouldn't buff because then you'll mess up your white. So that's nice for a lazy girl like me. So. I'm going to be using my BTR Pox Builder Gel as well as the top coat for this. I'm literally using those two things and the stickers and that's it. So this is probably my most simple set ever and they come out so pretty. Um, they look like salon quality nails. So I'm just giving you a look at the apex and um, the curve just so you have an idea of that. And here's the stickers right here. This is my favorite color pink, so I'm really excited to use these again. I did use them in the unboxing video. If you missed that and you're interested in it, um, definitely go check out that video because it was super fun. I did do gel X for that video. Um, so I'm just gonna grab my little nail stickers and I'm gonna start just randomly putting some stickers on every other nail. Um, just make sure you press them down really, really good. I'm using my finger, but you could use like a silicone tool or whatever you might think works. Just really press those babies down and you should be good to go. So I'm going to do every other nail. So the pointer finger and the ring finger, I am leaving just French. So this is so easy, so fast. If you need to get a set of nails on and you like to do press-ons, or if you want to do these as gel X, either way, you're going to blast through this so fast. So if you take some pre-French nails, like the ones by BTR Pox, these, whatever, um, they're definitely my two top favorites because they're the strongest by far. Um, if you just get some stickers and some charms and do your builder gel and top coat, like you're going to have an epic set super fast. Um, so if you are in a time crunch, I definitely recommend trying some of these pre-French nails because it looks like you took a lot more time than you did or it honestly looks like you went to the salon. Even better, right?
Okay, so here is the BT Art Box Builder Gel that I'm going to be using. Like I said, um, this works really good. Uh, I usually absolutely hate Builder Gels. This one I love. Just make sure with these type of nails that you're really getting your edges. And also, if you use stickers like me, really get every crevice that you possibly can because you do not want them lifting so if you do this and take the little extra second your stickers will not budge so just make sure you're completely covering that French tip and nothing will come off or get scratched and your stickers will stay in place and I don't know and I don't think that Novo Ovo has their own builder gel but they totally should because I'm sure it would be really great if you're watching this you should get a builder gel um, because I love all their products so much and um, yeah that's why we're using the BTR box one here but this one is awesome if you've tried it let me know if you haven't um, you should give it a try because it's really good it's the slippy kind which is great it is not thick and annoying because then I feel like if it's super thick it's hard to it's easy I mean to make like bumps and stuff and not get a super smooth application, but this one is effortless. So I did cure that builder gel layer for 60 seconds and now we're going in with the BT Art Box top coat and we're just going to do a hardy even layer, same thing to all the nails and then I'm just going to cure it for 60 seconds and that's literally it. Um, and wait until you see the finished product, how smooth and how gorgeous these come out and they look like salon quality nails. I'm so happy and so thrilled. Stay tuned to the end to see them completely done. They're gorgeous.